We're going to get some trending news. A special guest today, Rebecca Lord Johnson, is an artist going viral for painting weddings as they happen. Anything from the ceremony to the first dance. Here's one of her videos. Take a look. I went undercover as a guest to surprise a bride and groom on their wedding day. This wedding was set in the most gorgeous rainforest and it was so hard to choose a backdrop for the bride and groom. I actually picked this background, but then as I was painting the bride and groom in, I decided to completely change it and start it over. During the ceremony, I hid amongst the trees until I could introduce myself to the bride and groom. I knew the bride would probably recognize me though because she tried to book me and I told her I was already booked, but little did she know it was for her wedding. This painting was a gift from her high school friends, so they managed to get some information out of her about what sort of pose she would like in the painting. Initially, I was told she would probably like a dancing pose, but as I approached approach them at the end of the aisle, they actually changed their minds and went for this really nice, sweet and intimate portrait. And after the wedding, as usual, I did some touch-ups and this is the finished painting ready for varnish. Unbelievable. Hmm. Rebecca started doing this after teaching herself how to paint just a couple of years ago. She joins us live via Zoom. How are you this morning? I'm good. How are you, Marcus? Great. So first question, like you really just learned to paint a couple of years ago. I read you taught yourself in a couple of months. How did that work? Yes, so as you probably know, Melbourne had some of the longest lockdowns um, and during that time I was actually working from home in the construction industry and in my spare time I taught myself how to paint. It was actually mid-2021, so just over a year and a half ago. Did oh. you have any, you must have had some kind of skill with drawing or something, right? You didn't just start this out on whim. Yeah, so I did hyper-realistic pencil drawings beforehand, so I actually first started drawing live at weddings. So I did my first one of those in January 2021, but it was difficult in and out of lockdown, and there was so much demand for painting, so that's when I decided to teach myself specifically to do this. So let's talk about the wedding process here. So you get hired to go to the wedding. When do you decide at the wedding what you're going to paint and start painting? Because the clock's ticking, right? Like, you, you got to start painting at some point. How do you know you have the right moment? Yes, definitely the clock is ticking. Uh, luckily, I do have a consultation with the bride and groom beforehand, so I do have an idea of what I'm going to paint, but I actually spend about 45 minutes planning the composition, and I also use myself as a model, so I've got a little Apple Watch, uh, and I actually take photos of myself so I can get the proportions right on the day. Huh, and uh, what does it cost a couple to get one of these done? So I'm booked out until mid-2024 at the moment, so I'm just refining my pricing for 2024 now, uh, but it's upwards of about $3,000 Australian. Excellent. So do they take the painting home that night? You said there's varnishing and everything else, so I take it you get it maybe a couple days later or something? Yeah, so I take it home with me and I refine it just to make sure it looks good in natural lighting. And uh, generally it's about a three week turnaround. So I have plenty of time for it to dry and then varnish it as well. Do you travel all over the world too? Somebody in Chicago here wants to hire you. Can they hire you? <laughs> uh, well, I've done one in Singapore. I'm still sorting out the visa requirements for the US. So we will see, but fingers crossed I can get into a painting. That's unbelievable. Yeah, pretty cool stuff. Uh, thanks for joining us this morning. For more, you can check out Rebecca's website and social media. There it is right there on your screen. She's all over TikTok. Thanks again for joining us. Thank you for having me.